Welcome to this video on BGP Graceful Restart on Cilium. Uh, it's a new feature that is coming with Cilium 114, and it's a feature that makes your BGP configuration more robust. Um, and if you look at this uh, diagram, it's going to explain it a little bit why, but we will also look at a demo with and without Graceful Restart. And BGP Graceful Restart is a feature that has been around for a long time in the world of BGP and in routing protocols, but we are introducing it into Incilium. Um, so if you think about it, the, the way BGP is done with Incilium right now is by running a BGP daemon within the Cilium agent. So you can see when uh, your BGP session is up and running, you've got uh, you know, you can advertise your pod IP ranges, you can advertise your service IP to your peers. Um, and it works great. Uh, for example, you can see the, uh, the, if I look at the routing table of my peering router, I can see the route there, 10.0.0 slash 24. Now, what happens when I restart the Cilium agent, when I do an upgrade, well, because the PGP session is embedded within, um, the PGP daemon is embedded within Cilium, um, as soon as I um, restart the agent, the PGP session will go down and prefixes will be gone. And we'll, we'll see this in the demo. And really, that's not ideal. Right? We want to be able to separate the control plane from the data plane. But if you were to reboot Cilium agent or do an upgrade, you don't want to interruption to the traffic. And what Graceful Restart is able to do is for a period of time, while you are restarting the agent, your peer will be able to keep the routes in its routing table for a period of time. For example, you know, uh, say 20 seconds, because we know that you know after 10, 12 seconds, the agent will have restarted. So that's really a way to gracefully recover from a, um, a BGP event or um, a restart of your of your agents, and that enables us to separate the control plane from the data plane. Now let's have a look in a demo. So if we start with uh, um, my environment again, I get. Um, uh, my peering here, um, I've got one BGP session between Cilium and its remote node, and I'm going to connect to the node to show some of the information we see from the, the side of the, the, the peer with, with Cilium. Uh, so right now, um, Graceful Restart is enabled on the, on the peer as a, as a helper, uh, which means that will be um, keeping the PGP routes learned from Cilium while Cilium agent is restarting. If and when Cilium is enabled in Graceful Restart, which right now, the remote Graceful Restart mode is disabled, which means on Cilium we're not using Graceful Restart just yet. Um, and if we look at um, um, the routing table here, can see that the we've got the we're learning one route from Cilium and it's installing the routing table. Okay, it's just again it's working, working great. Now let's see what happens when I restart the Cilium agent. Again, we don't have Graceful Restart enabled. So PHP is gone. Um, and the BGP session goes inactive, the root, the 10.0.0/24 root is gone from the routing table. So as soon as we restart the agent, we get this interruption, right? Which again is not ideal. Um, so let's enable Graceful Restart to just see the difference in behavior. So uh, the Graceful Restart configuration is in within the Cilium BGP peering policy uh, manifest. And it's a per um, neighbor um, configuration. So we're going to enable Graceful Restart. And we're going to, and that's going to reset the session and kind of renegotiate 
um, with our peers. And we have a restart time seconds of 20 seconds. So which means that our peer needs to keep the rules for 20 seconds. And then if we still don't, you know, if it's a peer still hasn't heard back from Stadium during that time, they will kind of tore down, they will tear down that kind of relationship uh, with Celium, right? So let's just save this and let's apply it. And this time it's still negotiating right now. Sessions is now established. And you can see that the remote graceful restart mode is now in restart, right? So uh, our PSC Celium has enabled a graceful restart with um, uh, receive start time of 20 seconds. So again, it means the peer should keep the route for 20 seconds while Celium is restarted. Now we're going to have it be pretty quick, but we're going to again execute uh, a Celium daemon set restart and just see the difference in behavior. So what we want is really we want to she show the IP route and we want to show uh, the, the BGP relationship. Again, right now you see it's established. So let's restart with daemon. And we're going to IP root. And so um, what happens is, you know, I restarted the agent, but this time the roots is still there in the routing table. Uh, and you can see we are NSF. You know, the, the session is not just active, it's nonstop forwarding, right? So we are still keeping the roots in the routing table. We are still forwarding traffic while the steel image agent is restarting. And you can see how long um, the, um, we are keeping the, this route for, you know, we say up to 20 seconds. And now the session is reestablished. Uh, the steel image agent is back up and running. And the session has been restarted, you know, it's, it's, it's normal again. And I'm going to show you one more time what happens because um, during this kind of restart period, you can see the session, the, the root is marked as S, which is stale, right? And I guess that's just a, a way for to identify a root that is not healthy as such because uh, we know that there's an event happening on the other side, which is you know, why we've got graceful restart enabled here. Um, but that we, you know, within this, we're still forwarding the traffic. And then a few seconds later, again, the agent restart has been successful. The peering session has been properly reestablished and the session is marked, is, uh, the, the prefix is marked as valid again. And that's it. That's just again to show you uh, how we can handle the Cilium agent restart more gracefully uh, and not interrupt traffic while by using BGP graceful restart. And that's it. Thanks very much for watching. Bye. -bye.